Hi fellow Gunks Climber, I'm going to walk through the features of the Traps app. I've just installed it, so let's run the app for the first time. We're presented with a legal disclaimer that basically says your safety is your own responsibility. Click I agree. Now the app says an update is available. When you initially install the app, it's about 9 megabytes because it doesn't contain all the photos. We'll update later. Here we see an ordered list of routes and landmarks. You can scroll manually, by name, by GPS. You have to give your phone a little bit of time to contact all the satellites. So keep pressing continue until you're happy with the accuracy that you're getting. Or you can scroll by route number. Simply tap a route to see the details, including a description, base photos, and a link to the topo. Click topo to see the helicopter picture, and you can pinch to zoom, drag to pan, see the belays, the repels, and the descent. Tap on the topo to clear it, and you can click the tick link in the top right corner to add a route to your to-do list, or mark that you've already climbed it, including comments or beta. You can also click Previous and Next at the bottom to go to subsequent or preceding routes. Let's go back to the list and notice that it scrolls automatically to the last route you were looking at. Click Tick again to open that right-hand menu and we see the full To Do and Tick lists. Click Menu to open the left-hand menu, and we see Information and Gallery, which contain valuable resources for first-time gunks climbers. Below that, you can filter the route list based on Grade, Protection, Stars, and Advanced options like Name and whether or not you've climbed it before. Finally, click Download Update to get the rest of the photos and updated files for use offline. Well, that's everything in the new version. I know it's a lot, and I did go quickly. Maybe you should watch this video a few times. Remember, when you see us at the cliff, say hi and let us know what you think of the app. Climb on!